have been using my good old Kia Mickey Desk with a Dell E2011H on it. It was good enough for my needs, however, as everyone may have known, you only can get a limited space with the Mickey Desk. In my case, I even purchased the top shelves with it, so I was stuck with using a small and single monitor. In order for me to be able to use an extended screen, I had to put a small table next to the IKEA Mickey and place another Dell E2011H on top of it. After a long time of research, or should I say browsing some forums in Reddit, I decided that I've had enough of it and I needed to get a better desk and a bigger monitor as I also use this desk for working from time to time aside from casual gaming. The things I considered during the upgrade were the following. 1. It should be within a budget. As much as possible, I wanted to buy a desk second hand. 2. It should be minimalistic. As you have seen from the beginning of this video, I had a lot of stuffs on my desk. Things that I don't really need and just collects dust. I wanted to get rid of them. It should be comfortable to work at. That's number 4. Because from time to time, I do work from home so I need to make sure that I will be able to spend 8 hours working comfortably. In short, it should be better than my office desk. Lastly, it should be flexible. Yes, this is subjective. I know, but I wanted a workstation that will allow me to stand up and work without breaking the bank. I also wanted to have a desk that would last me a long time and will be able to sit multiple monitors down the road should I feel the need to upgrade. In addition to flexibility, I wanted it to be approved by my wife as she will be using it as well.
I brushed a lot of offers in Carousel and initially I wanted to get a corner desk. However, the price of the desks were beyond my budget and some are not really in good condition. After a lot of offers, I finally found one but it's not a corner desk. I chose this desk because as the seller mentioned, it's a custom made desk with a solid wood top surface and steel stands. He even boasted that the desk won't damage for another 100 years as it is heavy duty. This means that it's not only sturdy, but having an open legs would mean it would have a good airflow, so that's a plus. At first, I was skeptical on his claim that it's sturdy and solid. However, for the price, it's too good to pass on, so I went ahead and had it delivered. The desk came at night, and to my surprise, the seller did not only deliver literally, but also true to his words. Thanks a lot, pre-loved 78. For the monitor, I went with the LG Ultra Gear 34UC79G. It's an IPS curved ultra wide monitor with very wide viewing angles. It's the best of both worlds in terms of gaming and productivity due to its 144Hz refresh rate and wide aspect ratio, not to mention that it's also within my budget. 